In this lecture, we'll be taking a look at how we can do scroll detection in AlpineJS. So here I've created a page, and as you can see, we have some dummy content available. Now, the thing that we need to do over here is ensuring that whenever the page is scrolled a bit, that is, if it is not at the top, then we will change the background color of this header bar. So it's going to look something like this. So as soon as you go on top, it merges with the content and the whole background color is one. But when we scroll down a bit, there is a clear demarcation that this is header bar and the rest of the content is shown in a div on the HTML page. Now, in order to do this, we first of all create a state that's X data. And here we are saying scroll at top. Obviously, when the page loads, we are at the top of the page. And that's the reason why it's initialized with the value true. And here, this is the class which is basically adding the white background when it's not at the top. So here you can see it says if a scroll at top is not true, in that case, we'll be applying the BG white background. And here we are making use of the event scroll. And then we are looking what exactly is being scrolled. That's the window object we are looking at. So here we are setting scroll at top to true or false, depending on the page Y offset. Now, Y is the vertical scroll that we are monitoring over here. And we're saying if the Y offset is greater than 50, then set the scroll at top value to false otherwise set it to true and that's pretty much it that we are doing over here in order to detect the scrolling so here again we were going at the top you can see the scroll at top is set to true and the whole page looks like one and if i scroll down as soon as that page y offset value is greater than 50 we are setting scroll at top to false and we are applying the conditional class over here so now if I go and check it over here in my inspect menu under developer console, here you can see this BG white color is now being applied. And if I scroll now to the top, you'll notice that that class has been removed now. So that's how easy it is to detect scrolling using Alpine Trace.